Always fun when Michigan and Michigan State meet up. Now, just 10 days ago, these two played and MSU won 70 to 62. This one was not anywhere near that close. In the first half, Michigan's up by five and then Derek Walton hits a three. And if you thought the three balls would stop there, oh no. Xavier Simpson, another one near the top of the key. Not long after that, Walton again with a jab step. That's a 12-0 run for the Wolverines. Now there's a little bit of controversy here with Nick Ward and Mo Wagner. Dion, does Ward trip him or is this coincidental? Well, I think it was a little bit of a trip. I think Nick Ward let the frustration get a hold of him. Great call by the referee. Now Izzo disagrees, says it was not a great foul because it was a technical foul and he had to deal with it. Here's Wagner trying to get instant payback and it works. A nice layup for him. He would complete the three-point play at the line. And the final three seconds of the half, look at the timing here. Duncan Robinson just barely beats the buzzer. Look at the score at halftime, 55 to 29. This thing was lopsided in every which way. Eight three-pointers in the first half for the Michigan Wolverines. Their field goals, if you break that down a percentage, 75%. That's what Michigan was shooting. 55 points at the break against a green and white team led by Tom Izzo. And in the second half, Jess, things did not slow down. Uh, you think this game isn't personal. <laughs> Wilson dunking on Michigan State the whole night, staring at the crowd. Rockman, look, no one can stop him when he's in a groove getting to the rim. And we have not been talking about Derek Walton enough. He has been arguably the top point guard in the Big Ten over the last three weeks. Michigan dominates their rival. Sue Ann Roback with the head coach. All right, thanks a lot. Coach, when a team is shooting 70% like you were in the first half, you're pretty hard to beat. You had to be impressed with the team, the way your team not only shot, but the way that they really attacked Michigan State. We, we, we attacked well, but I think it was all about our defense again. We came out an angry team. You know, we came out with a team that had not, has got this another level to play at, and, and we're trying to get there, but it's not as natural for some of them. We, it, it, it was, our offense was great. It was more about our defense. We did a great job and a really good team with a great plan. Mo Wagner was so hot in the first half. And then just talk about Derek Walton as well, yeah. because he is such a leader for you this season. No, he is really, I, I've seen him grow so much over time, but all of a sudden there's a spike right now. That's happened when he saw this, this team, you know, he's, he's, he's deferred a lot to the other great players we've had over the, over the time, whether it was Karras, whether it was Zach, Nick, all those guys, he, 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 uh, he deferred. Now he understands, wait a minute, I might be the best player on this team. A thousand points, 400 rebounds, 400 assists. Uh, only Jalen Rose has that and the general Gary Grant. I mean, that's really in, in fine company right there.